The auditor says that there is a desperate need to improve mental health services. Suicide rates in the Northwest exceed the provincial rate by 50%. Frankly, they need to do data analysis and to sit back and look at it holistically to figure out like what is going on, not just provincially, but frankly, try to drill down by community too. Um, so that hasn't been done yet. The auditor found that some emergency staff did not receive training on how to care for a suicidal patient. Others sent at-risk patients away without a referral. The Rural and Remote Health Minister accepted the auditor's findings. He says that extra resources have been deployed, but was reluctant to prioritize the North. Health care needs are important to uh, to everyone across the province. Uh, certainly our rural and remote, which is which is my uh, my responsibility, I, I won't preclude one over the other. I think it's uh, necessary that we make sure we have the services for, for all people in, in rural and remote Saskatchewan. When you're looking at a health problem and suicide is a, is a health problem, it's also a social uh, and economic problem, they need to be looking at what are the root causes of suicide as well as what are the services available for people. When you're doing that, obviously you, you triage the communities that need that help the most. The auditor found another key issue in the north is video calls. The health authority uses these to connect community members with psychiatrists, but half of the patients don't show up. And the auditor says that the health authority doesn't follow up. The NDP wants to see a provincial suicide strategy and the province plans to do a jurisdictional scan of policy in other regions. But the auditor says that the province needs to act now. Kendall Latimer, CBC News, Regina.